All right, thanks, Doug. Well, the 2013 Sturgeon Spearing season officially opened at 6.30 this morning. And Jude Wilbers joins us with more on the less than favorable conditions for the second year in a row. Yeah, Mark, poor water clarity and suspect ice conditions are a recipe for a slow start. Well, spears on the Upper River Lakes had plenty of luck. 75 fish passed through the registration station at Critters in Winna County alone. A different story, our Justin Felder found out on the Big Lake. What is that? Not a bad day to be a fish in Lake Winnebago. Unless, of course, you're this fish and you met 13 year old Mitchell Ecker. Just seven sturgeon total registered at Stockbridge Harbor. Mitchell got his first ever. It's just kind of cool knowing that you get a uh, fish and it's kind of a rare thing to get one because not a lot of people can have the most of the luck to get one. All right. You want to guess? <laughs> 46.8. It does take luck and it takes beating the odds. According to the numbers we got from the Wisconsin DNR over the last five years, about 13% of people on average who buy a sturgeon spearing license actually get a fish last year, you see, exceptionally low with the warm temperatures. That's kind of what keeps people coming back is that when they do get a fish, it really means something because it doesn't happen every day. It doesn't happen every year. 35.8. Now, the big pro of not seeing a lot of fish here at the registration station means we could see a third straight 16 day season out on Lake Winnebago. Hey, good job, boy. What we're seeing come in at our station so far this morning suggests that we're going to be in the long haul for a full 16 day season unless conditions improve, which they could. We're seeing about six to eight feet. That's about it. We're about 18 feet of water, so that's all I've been hearing. Same thing. So to get one this year is real lucky. Came in like three feet under the ice and I started leaving the hole and just threw the spear. Say cheese. Some good luck for our friend Mitchell. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. And the other spears at least have a lot more days out on the ice to probably look forward to. Yes. 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 It's a fish. In Stockbridge, Justin Felder, Fox 11 Sports. Thanks a lot, Justin. Like you said, a tough day on Lake Winnebago where only 39 total sturgeon were harvested, six juvenile females, 16 adult females, 17 males, so a long way from the harvest caps there. The much better numbers on the upriver lakes where 140 total fish were harvested. That's 12 females, 46 adults, 82 males, and the harvest caps could potentially be reached tomorrow. While the 